It's lovely to see you here, Kate, at London Film and Comic Con. How have you been enjoying today? Oh, I've been having a great time. It's my first convention, so I didn't know what to expect. And I had no idea this world existed. And it's been really, really nice meeting people. And yeah, it's been lovely. You've had a fantastic season on Game of Thrones. It was revealed that you'd not only killed your husband, your own husband, that you framed the Lannisters as well. What did you think when you got that script? Well, I yeah, it was quite a shock, but it's also such a pleasure to play a character like Liza because she's so kind of off the scale and so damaged that it was a joy just to get to play all these different things and also to know all along until it was revealed at the moon door exactly what she'd been doing and how much she was involved in everything. So it's been brilliant. I mean, Littlefinger, you love him so much, obviously. What is it about him that you, that you think Liza finds so irresistible? I don't know, but you know, Liza's been in love with Littlefinger since she was a teenager, and he was her first and only love, and he's constantly played her all through her life. And she just, yeah, she's just besotted by him. I don't know why, but she's always been besotted by him, and to her death, she was besotted by him. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, no, yeah, she's just, everything that she did and all the terrible things she did were all for him, so he's quite a player, isn't he? Now, you mentioned the death scene there, which is quite something, wasn't it? Tell us a little bit about filming that. Oh, it was wonderful filming the death scene, actually. We spent all day and we had, in the moon door, we had crash mat, so I get pushed backwards onto the crash mat and then separately we filmed me hanging on a... Um, uh, or what do you call there's a harness thing up in the air and then they filmed me from underneath and then flipped it so I find it really interesting even as an actor seeing how because I was like how will they film me following so I found that out and just oh it was just great to have a death like that you know it was wonderful. What has it been like playing such an unstable character as Lysa because you know one minute she's you know giving Sansa lemon cakes the next minute she's bending her finger back or throwing her out the door. All that. I know see I see Liza as a really damaged woman who when Liza was a teenager she was a really sweet girl and then because of what happened with Littlefinger and because of all the miscarriages and stillbirths she had she ended up really damaged so I know she's a character that people love to hate but I'm always like oh she's so misunderstood <laughs> but she as an actor she's great because you're playing all these extremes and you can switch from one to the other and there's not many characters I know that I could ever have the freedom to do that so she was a great character to play. I mean sadly obviously we've lost you now but what would you like to see happening in Game of Thrones going forward? Oh my gosh I don't know because there's so many characters and so much that could happen. I would like to see Littlefinger get his comeuppance but I don't know because I haven't read beyond this so I don't actually know what happens to him. But I think he's due some payback, definitely. And to see Sansa having a bit of an easier time because she's had such a rough time up till now. So, yeah, but I would like to see Littlefinger meet some grisly end. <laughs> and finally, Kate, what can we look forward to from you next? You said you've been filming. I have. I've just finished two um, independent movies, one called The Witch, which I filmed in Canada. And I've just come back from France from filming a film called Couple in a Hole about a couple who live in a hole in a forest. So I think they should be out next year.